Now your Storm Track 7 forecast on KWWL. Hello there and happy Saturday. I'm meteorologist Kyle Keel with a check of your weekend forecast. It's going to kind of be an active weekend, especially today as we will have some scattered showers and thunderstorms moving through the area. A few of those storms could be on the stronger side, so threat tracker bumped to the yellow today. Keeping it in the yellow tomorrow. There's a slight risk of severe weather in our western hometowns, but as you know, in storm season, it all depends on what happens during the morning hours. So for today, the severe weather threat overall pretty low. I am concerned of a few severe storms here in our far eastern counties, and I would say even uh, up toward uh, Al-Qaeda and Guttenberg could be a couple stronger storms, but the higher risk is going to be east of the Mississippi River into Illinois. Uh, we are concerned of maybe uh, some hail, maybe a quick gust of wind, and a couple of tornadoes also possible here as we head into the early afternoon hours. So early this morning, I'm not too concerned about severe weather, but we are tracking a line of showers and thunderstorms that could certainly produce some locally heavy rain, maybe some small hail. It's as we head toward lunchtime that we have to watch for a few storms here, uh, especially here in northeastern Iowa for that potential of severe weather. Again, this is not going to be a widespread outbreak, but a couple of those storms could get stronger, maybe rotate and produce a quick tornado or some uh, large hail and gusty winds. So you'll want to stay weather aware, especially if you live in northeastern Iowa. By 4 o'clock this afternoon, we'll keep scattered showers, a couple thunderstorms in the forecast. This activity tracks off to the northeast this evening and will be left with a partly cloudy to mostly clear sky overnight. As we head into Sunday morning, there could be a few patchy areas of fog early on. Otherwise, we'll see a partly sunny sky. And we'll have to watch that activity here off to the northwest because this could dive a little farther to the south and that could impact our weather here throughout the day. So uh, Sunday's forecast, a little less confidence. Again, you have the idea that there are a few showers and thunderstorms in the forecast. It just all kind of depends on what happens with that complex in the morning. So you'll certainly want to stay up to date. Uh, we'll frequently update the forecast here between now and Sunday. For today, our forecast has temperatures in the lower to middle 70s with some showers and thunderstorms. We'll have a variable wind at 10 to 15. We'll start off to the east and kind of switch off to the south here as we head into the evening. Our winds will be west and south tonight as the sky becomes partly cloudy. There could be some patchy areas of fog with overnight lows in the upper 50s to near 60 degrees. Tomorrow it's going to be a warm and humid day. We'll have that partly sunny sky with the chance for a few showers and thunderstorms. Again, we'll have to watch the trends very closely. We'll keep scattered showers and thunderstorms in the forecast on Monday with highs in the lower 80s. So it's going to be fairly humid those days as well as we get those dew points in the middle and upper 60s. So it is going to certainly feel like summer. In fact, the unofficial start of summer is on Memorial Day. We'll kind of have a stagnant weather pattern here for the first half of the work week with uh, several chances for showers and thunderstorms. Not all day washouts, but certainly off and on chances are there. Highs will be in the upper 70s here through next week.